Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and uh, we're going to talk about a little something that is mysterious and that Microsoft actually doesn't want to talk about, which is kind of interesting. So if you are in version of the May 2020 update, version 2004, because it's only there that this is showing up. It doesn't show apparently on other uh, versions. So if you go into your settings app, and you go into system and you go to the about tab something interesting is um, here and it's the fact that it tells you that you have windows feature experience pack and it gives you a version number so somebody pointed out that this was in there and wondered what it was. Mary Jo Foley of All About Microsoft has checked it out, asked questions in which she had answers that were pretty much don't ask any questions. So it's kind of funny uh, that it is written in the specifications in the about page, but that nothing, they don't want to say nothing about it. I mean, come on, if it's there, at least give us a little bit of details. You know, even just a phrase like, well, you know, upcoming features will go through this. So what we learn is that there is, so when Windows 10 is installed, there are some, you know, apps that come with it that are not part of Windows, but that are installed and that you can use. So one of them, and apparently the Windows Feature Experience Pack includes that. One of them is Screen Snip. If you've been using the Screen Snip, you have an app that comes from what is this feature, Windows Feature Experience Pack, apparently. What we also learn is that this is possibly going to be used to sideload different features that would be coming to Windows, but not part of Windows itself. So this is interesting. Um, and there's a lot of talk about how this in some way could be timed in with the famous Windows 10 uh, X coming later uh, this year or early next year. So there's a lot of mystery surrounding this, but um, if you have moved to the Windows 10 version 2004 or the May 2020 update, this is something you will see on your computer that you have a phrase that says Windows Feature Experience Pack and a version number. And this is interesting. I'm going to be kind of looking at this regularly to see if it has any, um, you know, um, numbers, or if it upgrades with different updates and so on to different version numbers. Um, I got to say, the communication at Microsoft is really bad. I mean, come on, why are you just not telling us what this is, or at least giving us give us a hint of what it's all about? But apparently it has to do with side features that could be side loaded and that are from a package called the Windows Experience Pack, apparently. Uh, so if you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up and thank you for watching.